Hey guys, we are back with another Toronto Maple Leafs GM mode, and here I am just, I'm, I'm done with losing. <laughs> we are going to make a trade to Anaheim for John Gibson. Uh, he's, li he, he's the, he's the only, uh, candidate who we'd be able to win with now. I mean, his, his stats, again, aren't great, but it's only, it's only seven games into the season, so... He's got a lot of time to shape up, and we're going to need to get Hackett back in return as well. Because we're going to trade Bernier, we're going to trade Rusu, and we're going to trade two seconds. And boom, there you go. We have an elite goaltender now, boys. <laughs> we, there's no excuses as to why we should be uh, losing now. And you know what? We didn't have to give up uh, any of our uh, of our good prospects either we we still have four and a half red star patrick dia and the four and a half uh yellow star uh raymakers who is not on the minor league team so you know what what if we gave dia some time instead of nielsen you know what nielsen's been pretty good as a backup so yeah i think i'll just give dia some more time in the in the minors yeah there you go he's still in there uh Oh, extra attacker. No, goaltender. There you go, Gibson. Get in there, son. <laughs> There's absolutely no excuses now as to why we're not a playoff team. Absolutely none. I mean, we've pretty much filled out our entire roster when you, when you uh, look at it here. I mean, there's a, there's a f whole, whole first line of legitimate first liners. Whole legitimate second line, legitimate third line, legitimate fourth line. It's, it's like, and then the only thing we're missing is another top two defenseman. That's literally, that. that's it. <laughs> we have a starting goaltender. We should be set. All right, now. Uh, with that being said, let's go ahead with the simulation. Let's see how we do it in our first game with John Gibson. There you go. Three to two to start it out. And there you go, five to four. I mean, uh, he's he's letting in the goals, but we scored, obviously, more than they did. So, there you go. Nice win. And let's go up to the next time the scout's going to appear, I guess. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right. <laughs> I, I, I'm just... <laughs> I kind of wanted to make the playoffs this year. Want to show you guys a, a, a good team for year three. And for years to come. <laughs> so. This this will be. Ho hopefully a good. Uh, good trade that works out for us. And. Uh, hopefully it works out for Anaheim too. If for, for, for their sakes. So uh, yeah. There's the, the scout there. Okay. So. Uh, a couple games here. Uh, there you go. Nice win. Shutout win, actually, for John Gibson. Is that his first shutout of the year? It might be. Or, well, at least for us, you know. There you go. 4-3. Keep it going, boys. Barry's got 8 assists. JVR, 7 goals. Kalorin's plus 5. There you go. This is what I like to see. This is what I like to see, boys. <laughs> this is the first roster I've had this much confidence in quite some time, boys. <laughs> Look at us go. Keep it going, boys. We'll be in the playoffs in no time. We'll be winning the Stanley Cup in no time. There you go. 10 and 5. That was a good trade. I'm saying it right now, boys. That was a very good trade. I mean, it may not have been the most realistic, but you know what? <laughs> we we haven't I haven't won the Stanley Cup in a GM mode since Carolina. And that was three GM modes now ago. <laughs> that was back in NHL 15. So, uh, yeah. Because, I mean, we've we've done, what, so far this year we've done uh, Vancouver, we've done Minnesota, and now Toronto in, in NHL Legacy slash 16. So, and <laughs> I did not win, it, win the Stanley Cup at all with... Uh, either Minnesota or Vancouver, if you've been catching up with that, so uh, or if you watched either of those series, so uh, looking a lot better here though in Toronto, it really is. Morgan Riley with 19 assists now, so we're we're getting a whole team effort here. It looks like, <laughs> besides against Chicago, 
There you go. Nice win. 14 and 7. We're double of 500. We have a 750 ratio. Or a point ratio there, I guess. That's great. Ah, lost against Philly. Come on, boys. Get back. Get back here uh, in the home and home. They're 16, 6, and 2, though, so they're pretty good as well. Yeah, there you go. All right, not going to win them all. Uh, but still, we need to uh, we need to go on a winning streak here. Come on, boys. We definitely have the talent to do it now. We definitely do. There you go. Nice win. All right, scouting assignment. Uh, you know what? I'm not even sure what to scout anymore because we have John Gibson, we have Raymakers, we have Dia in net. <laughs> that's that's pretty uh, that's a pretty filthy future. So you know what? Forwards or defensemen? I think. I don't even know what to scout anymore. We'll just, I guess we'll go defenseman. Because we still got Mitch Marner. We got, uh, uh, what's his name? Gauthier. Gauthier, however it's pronounced. <laughs> we have a plethora of, of, of prospects. So, yeah, we're going to do defenseman here. Because I'm pretty sure all of our young defensemen are playing in the NHL. Who we want to be playing in the NHL anyway. So, yeah, we're 16-9. and nine, So, let's keep going. Actually, Well, actually, let's check out the stats. I want to... I'm sort of interested to see this. Because Kucherov already has 15 goals. And Riley, I, ha I saw, had 24 assists. So we're going to get that checked on real quick. So 25 games played. And <laughs> 32 points for Morgan Riley. 29 for Johnson. 27 for Kucherov. 24 for JVR. 24 for Nylander. 23 for Kadri. My God, what a filthy... <laughs> Top line, and or not even top line, top lines, I should say. My God, Kadri, he's our first line center, and he's he's got the least amount of points among those, uh, these, uh, these six right here. Uh, I mean, that's, that's, <laughs> that's amazing. We have six almost point per game players. That's, <laughs> that's crazy, dude. Uh, Goldobin, 19, Griffith, 16, Barry, 15, all these guys down here. So that that's great. Let's check out how John Gibson's doing. He, yeah, he's he's definitely picking up with the workload. <laughs> Much better than jo uh, Jonathan Bernier. All right, let's uh, let's keep going. Yeah, six another six weeks. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. There you go. Seven to one. <laughs> I'm loving this team here in Toronto so far, boys. Absolutely loving it. We're gonna be a dynasty. First time since 67. That'd be big. That would be really big for this team. There you go. Nice 2 1 win against Vancouver. <laughs> Detroit, they're not the greatest. Come on, boys. Secure win. There you go, oh, boys. 19 and 9. That, that <laughs> We're looking really good so far, boys. We are looking really good. If we don't slow down. <laughs> that's that's almost a guaranteed uh, president's trophy. Oh my God! Look at this. This is outstanding. Twenty and nine for the Toronto Maple Leafs in year three. <laughs> we are looking really good so far. All right, loss overtime loss though against uh, Tampa Bay. We got a we got a point out of it. There you go. Nice win against Columbus. <laughs> How many games have we lost with uh, this new roster with John Gibson? Like, uh, four? Because <laughs> we started the episode... Yeah, we started the episode three and three. We've lost six games with John Gibson. And we have won 20. <laughs> so, yeah. I, I, I'd say that was a pretty fair trade. I mean, look at this. We're, t we're, we're killing it. 24, 9, and 1. My God, look at this. <laughs> look at the point totals on the side. It's only January. Kucherov's on point, uh, on, on pace for, uh, I'd say, 40 goals. Uh, Riley's on pace for uh, 55 or 60 assist season. I mean, that's just <laughs> unbelievable. Heading into this season especially. Didn't think we were going to be this good. <laughs> but uh, we then again, we did make a whole ton of... Uh, <laughs> drastic trades, so, I mean, you know, can't, uh, can't take all the credit, though, because, uh, 
we had quite a few jumps over the offseason in, uh, in Nylander, Goldobin, all those guys. So, I mean, this team, <laughs> it's just, I mean, except for the past couple games, it has been tearing it up. Come on, boys, get back here against the Oilers. There you go. There's a nice win. Nashville, Tampa, uh, Tampa Bay coming up as well. And we have a loss against Nashville, but you know what? I, that that's that doesn't even phase me with this team right now. As long as we don't go on like a ten game losing streak with this team, I I have I have complete confidence in this roster right now, boys. You don't even know. This is the first time I felt, as I said, this is the first time I felt this confident about a roster since year nine in Carolina. My God. <laughs> that was the last Stanley Cup I won in uh, in GM mode for for YouTube anyways. All right, so uh there's another 6 weeks. Uh let's check out the player stats. Come on, get a load in here. There you go, 42 games. Let's see. So Johnson and Riley are point per game players. Kadri 40 points, so we slow down a little bit, but that, I mean, that's expected. JVR at 39, Kucherov 38, Nylander 37, Goldome 31. I mean, look at this. This is a filthy roster right now. Goaltenders, John Gibson. Oh, pfft, pfft. Yeah, th this is the real hero, boys. John Gibson. 93.1 <laughs> .1, per uh, save percentage and 2.06 goals against average. What a stud. I'm so happy we traded for him. Hold on. Let's check out uh, Diaz stats actually in the AHL. I'm also interested to see Marner. I mean, may as well. It, they're, uh, we want to try to grow those red stars. Uh, Brown, Gauthier with 34. Yeah, Mark 32. Marner with 30. All right, so not bad. I kind of wish they were getting, getting a little more points, you know, <laughs> maybe a point per game for each of these guys, but it doesn't matter too much right now, as long as they're having good seasons. Dia, yeah, he's do, he's doing pretty good down here. You know, yeah, I'll just leave him down here to uh, maybe grow a little more to like a 75, 76 over the offseason, and then maybe then we bring him up to the NHL. Who knows? Uh, Yeah, let's keep going. I mean... Actually, I want to. I do want to check out the team stats. Yeah, look at this. We're third in the NHL, right behind the Islanders and Philly. So, yeah, one point behind the Islanders, six behind Philly. So that's great. Uh, goals for per game, we are killing it. Three point five two goals against per game. We are third. Two point four five. What an improvement for the Toronto Maple Leafs. Power play second, <laughs> with twenty five point nine. And the penalty kill, uh, it's not bad. 82.2, 10th in the league. So, I mean, it's not great like Calgary or Dallas up here, but it's getting it done <laughs> compared to the rest of the NHL down here. I mean, my God, most of the teams are in the 70s, actually, in, at least in the bottom 10. That's weird. The penalty kill seems to have been uh, reduced in this game a little bit, but... Hey, I mean, a power play is getting it done. Our goals against are getting it done. Our goals for are getting it done. <laughs> I can't complain about the penalty kill. I really can't. They're, they're, they're solid. They're not great, but they're solid. So <laughs> let's just keep going, boys. Uh, yeah, another six weeks. One, two, three, four, five, six. There we go, up to the trade deadline. And then uh, we'll look at the stats once more after that, and we'll call it a video. Oh, man. <laughs> I was not expecting uh, for us to be this good with John Gibson in that. I really was not. Keep it going, boys. I mean, 31, 12, and a 1. When was the last time you saw Toronto with that, re with that record? I mean, that's, that's amazing. <laughs> Keep it going. Yeah, All-Star game. Actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll check that out. We're the green All-Stars, right? Yeah, Green's the East. All right, so. Vashkin's again, post uh, Vander Kane. Line two, Skinner, Giroux, Stahl. Marshan, Barkov, Zetterberg. There's not a single Toronto Maple Leaf in the four core. What is going on, uh, EA Sports? What, <laughs> why is there no Maple Leafs in the forwards? The, we, we, we've been killing it. 
Okay, Latang Subban. There you go, Morgan Riley. <laughs> Only one Maple Leaf on the skaters. Wow. And then Gold Tent. Okay, good, good. <laughs> Gibbs is in there. I was gonna say if Gibson's not in the All Star game, then I, I don't know what those uh, I don't know what those guys are doing over there at NHL. But uh, I'll have whatever they're having. Because <laughs> uh, man, those. Uh, <laughs> I mean, we're just killing it. We really are. Keep it going, boys. Come on, boys. Get it going here against Nashville. They're not that great. Let's go. There you go. Nice win, boys. I mean, I don't even have to say anything anymore. They just get it done. <laughs> I like what I see, boys. If we can carry over the same mentality in the playoffs, oh, God, we'll, we'll be a dangerous team for years to come. I mean, <laughs> with minimal change. We're such a young team, and we're so... These guys are just, they keep, they keep tearing it up. I, I don't know what's going on, but this is, this is probably the best team I've had in GM mode in quite some time. YouTube or offline, doesn't even matter. <laughs> this, this, yeah. Year three Toronto Maple Leafs is officially one of the best teams I've, I've had in quite some time. Doesn't even matter what happens at the second part of the season. We're already... <laughs> we're, we're, we pretty much, uh, we, we would have to lose every single game from now on in order to lose our playoff spot. I mean, we are killing it, boys. Keep it going. 37, 13, and 1. And it just keeps climbing from there. All right. <laughs> there's a, there's a regulation loss. Come on, get back here against New Jersey. They're not good. Uh, oh, <laughs> all right. Well, it was an overtime loss, so we got a point out of it. But at this point, we're it, it, we're we're going President's Trophy. We're we're talking about President's Trophy material here. So let's get it going, boys. Oh man, loving this team. Florida. Uh, all right, regulation loss as well. Ugh. Come on, boys. Big bounce back against Ottawa. Uh, come on, don't do this to me late on in the season. After I just got done praising you for how for how good you've been to me. So far this season. Come on against Calgary and Vancouver. Win those two. There you go. Nice win. Nice win. Can we get 40? Can we get 40 against Vancouver? They're terrible. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> of course, we win against teams like Calgary, but we, we lose against uh, Vancouver. Come on now. Against Anaheim. Last game of the simulation for now. There you go. 3-0. All right. Let's get some more defensemen. We are killing it, boys. Loving it. All right, OHL, yep. <laughs> 40, 16, and 3. Who would have thought it? I mean, <sighs> I think uh, GM of the Weir, uh, GM of the Weir, GM of the Year <laughs> award goes to yours truly. If we, Especially if we could win the Stanley Cup, my God. Uh, okay, so Riley, so no one's a point per game player now, but you know what? That's all right. We we're <laughs> we're all spread out the points. Uh, Riley with fifty three and fifty nine, Kadri with fifty two, Johnson fifty one, Kadri or uh, pff, Kadri. I'm all over the place today. I can't even talk. Kucherov and JVR with fifty, Goldobin forty nine, Nylander forty eight. I mean, it's literally incremental by one going down until Nylander and Barry. <laughs> I mean, Barry has 40 points, so that's nothing to laugh at either. Griffith, 38. That's solid for the third liner, you know, especially power play time. Uh, Gardner, Kalorn. I mean, we're lit. We're just... <laughs> this is amazing. And John Gibson, the real MVP. 2.04 goals against average. And a 93 save percentage with how many shutouts? Six. All right, not bad. And three assists, actually, as well. Killing it here in Toronto, boys. <laughs> Absolutely killing it. Team standings, we're second in the NHL. 11 points behind Philadelphia, so it doesn't look like we'll... <sighs> we could catch up to them, but we're going to have to go on a big winning streak, and we're going to have to hope that Philly sort of drops off a little bit in the uh, last part of the season. But man, we're pulling away from the rest of the pack, man. We really are. 
Uh, I mean, goals against goals for per game were second, right behind Philly. Uh, but goals against per game, we are first in the NHL. And in the playoffs, defense is what matters. And not only that, we have offense too. It's looking really good for the Toronto Maple Leafs right now. I mean, we're 0.1 percentage behind Philly on the power play. We are okay, so we're we're 12th in the league in penalty kill, but I mean, there's not much of a difference here between 12th and let's say seventh with with Washington. There's it's only like 1.5, 1.4 difference, so it's really. It's not that bad, you know. We 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 can we can suffer in one area, I think, Cause especially since we're killing the re almost the rest of the league in e in every other category. So, I mean, boys, <laughs> I really don't think we need to make any changes now. I think I think we're set. <laughs> Maybe even for the next five years or so. So, uh, yeah, let me know. But I I really. <laughs> I think we should just continue into the playoffs with this team, and uh, we're we're in the playoffs, no doubt. We're in the playoffs, yeah. Yep, yeah, boys, we made the playoffs. I think uh, unless we just go, you know lose every single game from now on, but I doubt that's gonna happen. Uh, <laughs> this is in Vancouver. So with that, I'll see you guys in the next one.